All right, welcome to Smokers UK Rap Files. I'm your boy Journalist, and on this one, we have somebody that in the house I'm currently living in, these motherfuckers play this boy all the time. However, I've not seen anybody actually suggest this boy to me in the comment sections since I've been doing these. So I was like, let me showcase this person, one, and then two, I wanted to kind of go through the song in a more analytical aspect. So today we are here to listen to, I believe how you say his name is Berwin. Uh, it's called Path to Satisfaction. If I could get a feature from this boy for myself or the homie that uh, listens to him in the house, it would be amazing. That being said, uh, if you could please hit that like, that subscribe. Patreon's in the description box. Thank you very much for joining me. And let's check this one out. Know the hate till when you're getting paid, but I got money on my mind. Facts. Fuck saving it, I wanna waste it. Spend it on tonight. Cause you don't get nothing in this world without a price. Oh, you don't get nothing in this world by being nice. Oh, you don't get nothing in this world unless you fight. But if I should die on my path to satisfaction. See, the, for me, just the the musical stylings that he's providing on here, I'm just like, I don't hear a lot of artists from the UK doing anything like this. And then he's about to rap. Got the LV on, on a rap. Like, this motherfucker is cold. I really enjoy listening to him because it always, it sounds so refreshing and new. And it's some stuff that I'm just like, I would really like to work with. So this is why I'm like, I really enjoy him as an artist. And then, not to take the piss out the boy, but I could tell how they shooting this. My boy's not that tall. They are shooting this in a way where you don't really think about his height. And the only reason I'm thinking about Blood's height is because I come from a place where they teach you about how to shoot a person that may not be particularly as tall as everybody in the shot. And they're using all the fucking techniques, all of them. I'll just say a little prayer for me. I'll just say a little prayer for me. I got the LV pattern, high fashion, lights, camera action, action. cameras flashing. Whatever happens, all my brodies got a pattern. Crimes of passion, all my brodies love the action. Action. But if anything should happen on this path to satisfaction, like the plane should end up crashing and I don't survive the landing. Uh -huh. Tell them I was loving, I was kind Love and understanding. understanding. Tell them how I tried and then I died and then I vanished. Uh -huh. Tell them how I come up from the mud but still I managed. What else? The song goes double platinum but the driver ends up crashing. What? Tell them how I when I heard that line, I was like, this motherfucker right here, because that's to me. Like, if you watch the channel, you know I really, really fuck with Cadet. And the first time I ever came to the UK, I was my plane literally landed back in fucking LA, and I get an alert talking about fucking Cadet had died from a fucking like car crash, like not even outside doing no knucklehead shit, just fucking circumstantial accident has taken a potential prolific artist off the fucking table so when my man says that the album went double platinum but the car ended up crashing i'm like fucking hell like nick like that's the shit that be the worst like fuck man but still I manage that the song goes double platinum but the driver ends up crashing tell them how i always made it happen look at me shine come on oh my man the satisfaction say what say what Come on, come on, hey! Just say a little breath for me. Oh, my mama 
that one that's in Berwin's fucking left hand, the one in the center of the screen. I had that motherfucker as a little kid, cuz. Shout out to Barney, bro. I had not, obviously not that exact one, but that exact style one. I had that one as a youth. Come on, smile up. <laughs> Say a little prayer for me. All right, I should. We're gonna hit that back. Bro, this song is so good. Like, it's so good for so many reasons. And I'm just like, how do not, like, what is it, 37,000 or some shit like that? Yeah, how the fuck is only 37,000 people to listen to this motherfucking song? Now, granted, it's just YouTube, could be doing numbers on other streaming platforms, but the fact that this boy has less than 20,000 subs and 37,000 plays on this fucking video is just criminal to me. The musicality of the song, the messaging, the lyrics, fucking everything, even the video is hard. Like, god damn it. No, shout out to this boy. Like, quality fucking music, hands down, like. Uh, I, I, we just came to this realization, me and the homie Cook, in another video. I think it was a Jerry Cinnamon video. The reason I don't give songs 10s is because I don't feel like that's a song I wish I had have written. And that's a song that will get a 10 for me. So I don't feel like I wish I had written this song, but fuck do I think it's a, an amazing piece of music. So that's why I have to give it a 9. Like, hands down. This is him and uh, Loyal Carner are two of my... So Bearwin, Loyal Carner, and Nux. If I could work with those three as far as just like UK like rap, like fuck, man. I feel like we'd make some magical shit because them three motherfuckers right there, boy. Who they got some fire, cuz. Fire. That being said, this is going to be the end of it for me. Uh, please hit that like for the algorithm. Sub the notification bell so you can help grow the channel and not miss the next video. Patreon if you want to see any of the videos that we upload that I can't get on the YouTube. All that goes over there. And that being said, I will see you guys on the next one. Thank you very much for joining me. I hope you have a great rest of your day, evening, or afternoon. And I'm out of here. Peace.